So I just finished filming my, what's my hostel bag. I made a huge mess, guys. Like, honestly, look at all of this. But I'm going <clears> to <throat> clear it up and whatever. Before I do that, I just want to quickly show you the house update. Um, sorry, my husband's like texting me. Um, let me quickly show you the house update. I've actually been very, very busy recently. I just haven't really vlogged a lot. Um, like I'm like towards the end of my pregnancy. I'm just trying to lay low and also get my house and everything ready for the baby to come. But I'm going to quickly show you everything that we did. Oh, I can't even get up, guys. So, um, obviously, I'm in my room right now. The bed used to be here. We actually changed up the room, and I kind of like it. I prefer it this way. It looks so much bigger. His um, changes table will come in tomorrow. So, we're going to put that over there. Pardon me, I'm going to show you when it's all set up by tomorrow. But the most basket is coming a couple days. So, this is what we have for right now. Sorry about the mess on the floor. But for now, we have the bed on this side. I prefer it this side, I'm not gonna lie. And then we have his cot. This is his cot, guys. I actually got it from my kid, I'm obsessed with it. And the best thing I love about it, and I didn't even know, it actually turns into a day bed. So when he's like one, I can like, I just take these, one, one of these, and then it could be in a day bed. So I love it. I put his, um, his thing he sleeps in, and his teddy. And then I bought the, what do they call this? The the snuggle nest. I can't wait, I got it. Um, I put it in here. And I also purchased his diaper bag that I put in here. Then obviously you guys know his little thing. I'm gonna keep that for now. I might ch I might move it towards his chest of drawer, but we we shall see when it's here. Um, so this is looking like for the um, our bedroom, we our wardrobe's coming and then that is it. I'm gonna quickly show you the bathroom. The bathroom is so basically the whole house is done. I just need to get two more things for the living room and like the extra bits, like the mirrors and the lamps, but everything is done. So we're in the bathroom, and basically, this is what the bathroom is looking like. Um, we finally got a mirror. I really, really like this mirror. I'm gonna leave it here, here now, but my my vision is to put it here. I was gonna get that big mirror that you open, I might still do that, but for now, we put that there um in the kitchen um we got the cook on it, everything um i set it up the pump and then i have my breast storage bags which basically is just storage bags for like if you go to my mom that i can breast pump put it in it to give it to her now this is when i get excited so Guys, before I show you, I'm gonna drink because I'm so thirsty. We honestly need to get curtains for the living room and the bedroom. That is the next step because that seriously, there's like people can see us. Like we need to do that. But I'm gonna flip the camera and show you guys the living room. I'm super obsessed with it. Sorry about the food on the floor, but this is my living room. Just gonna come here. So when you walk in, you see the sofa, the table. And then I got his bouncer from Ikea and then his, um, what are they called? This is a bouncer. I don't know what these are called, but we're going to keep them for here for now. And then this is my sofa. Sorry about the pillows. I sat down, but this is my sofa. I'm so obsessed with it. I love it. It's a decent size. I might get another one and put it on this side, but I'm obsessed with it. It's a free seat so far. It comes with these pillows. Love it. And then this is the table we got. I'm obsessed with it. It's perfect under the arch. So we might get curved straight down, but the windows, the patio door with the table, it just blends in. I'm obsessed with the way it looks. This is where we're going to eat, have breakfast, all of that. I'm not going to keep this here for now. I'm going to buy something to put on it. But for now, it's just this is just something I want just for decoration. And then obviously, I have my frames. My husband, I'm still going to get more. Um, but this is what it's looking like. And obviously, we're getting a new TV soon. Um, and I need to get a bench and put it there and put the big TV. This is just Zane's TV, my son's TV, but we're obviously having it for now for us to watch. But that is the update of... So my that is basically the update of the house. Um, I'm obsessed with it. 
honestly i'm obsessed with it i love it i'm so excited for more of the extra furniture that's gonna come in but i'm so happy that my living room's done and i'm so happy i got it done before i'm done because i wanted to sit in my living room and i'm done and i finally got it done so i'm so excited i might do ramadan series i don't know but i probably will ramadan is on saturday so hopefully i might do it if i if i don't i might just do <sighs> my breath i might just do regular vlogs but i'm 36 weeks today and i'm 37 tomorrow so nearly there guys nearly there my due date's on the 22nd of april so i'm excited honestly i'm ready for him we're ready for him the house is ready for him i'm just i'm, I'm excited um let me just quickly see you guys back here um but yeah I'm so excited, honestly, but I'm gonna go tie up the mess that I made now. Oh, guys. <laughs> I have to fully, like, oh, fix everything into the bag, but I'm gonna quickly do that and then I will vlog later on. So. So it's been a couple of hours. I have, like, sauce all over my face. It's been a couple of hours since I vlogged. Um, I literally edited half of um moss monster bag and i'm gonna continue like editing late like later but for now i just want to sit down and watch and eat because i was so hungry um my lips look kind of big right now but a long time ago i decided to watch this thing called your handle and i'm obsessed with it oh my god I just took off my earring thing this is so annoying oh my god this is actually so annoying uh okay oh oh my god i just dropped my earring this this is why you should never fiddle with your earrings because you can drop the little and i have nails on oh anyways i'm re-watching season two of two hours to handle because i'm obsessed with it and like this is actually one of my favorite seasons um so I'm re-watching it. I hope my earring don't fall off. And I'm just eating. Yep, it fell off. Ooh, this is so annoying. And I'm just eating leftover foods that me and my husband had when we went out. Because, uh, guys, I get hungry every minute, like, every day. But, yeah, I'm just literally eating. And I should be eating when you so far. I actually should be eating over there on the table. But don't judge. I haven't spilled anything. God forbid. But I honestly can't be asked to sit on a bony chair, especially when I'm 36 weeks pregnant. I need support on my back, so sorry, guys. But my lips look so plumped. I'm so... Like, I got lip fillers in January, and I feel like they're plumped sometimes because of, of my pregnancy, but they've honestly have never gone down since I got them down. I love it. I'll leave my woman on the down bar. She's actually my brother-in-law's best friend. We get the discounts. <laughs> But, yeah, guys, the, is night time starting to fall down. I'm honestly just sitting here, chilling. Wow. Um, I feel like I'm going to cook later on because I know I'm going to get hungry. But at the same time, I'm like, fuck it. <laughs> but, yeah. But, yeah, I can't wait. Um, basically, there's two vlogs that I need to upload, and then there's, I'm think, I'm uploading the What's My Hustle Bag tomorrow, and then I'm going to upload two vlogs, um, probably day after, but this vlog is not going to be uploaded till, like, a week or so like i've been filming a lot of vlogs because like i said in the previous vlog it's just easier for me to vlog sometimes because i'm just so like not even lazy but i'm just like at the end of my pregnancy and i get so tired so it's really hard for me to sit down get ready film a video i feel like vlogging is like easier and especially because i have so much stuff to show you guys and content you'll see a lot of vlogs on my channel so i do have a couple of vlogs that I have two videos, two, well, one vlog is edited, ready to upload, and I have another vlog that I need to edit and upload, but this vlog will be edited and uploaded by mid of April, so 
yeah or maybe yeah because it won't make sense if i upload this before i don't know regardless of what order there'll be vlogs up on the channel um yeah and i'm gonna try and see if i'm gonna do the ramadan series because it's fun in ramadan like we don't we fasten that and obviously because i am pregnant like i'm not gonna be fasting a lot because i'm pregnant but i do want to capture like the ramadan and hopefully the day i go into labor like when i'm my work my wall breaks and that so hopefully i my wall breaks sooner than later my due date's on the 22nd so i'm hoping like in the beginning around april but oh and also if you guys want a little update i had my midwife appointment today but really well she um was obviously telling me like basically there was a little incident that happened and it was so annoying but basically i was like um when i went into i uploaded a video explaining about when i went into hospital and that and um when i went into hospital that week i never got a follow-up on my next appointment and the only appointment that i got was the 14th of april appointment and i was like to myself there's no way that's my last appointment that i'm going in to see my midwife and that's a week before my due date because like anything can happen i can go into labor that quickly and i haven't even done like a birth plan schedule like there's no way i'm my appointment is that week before my due date and i have no plan whatsoever of my birth um so i called them up explained to them rose of concern whatever and originally you're supposed to have an appointment after six weeks um 40 weeks and then you give birth or whatever but sometimes people just give birth early like that's why you just need to know what you're doing for your birth so anyway they booked the 36 weeks originally and then i had that today the woman was like you were supposed to have this book time ago but anyways i called her she booked it i went in to save my husband uh basically they were they they checked me baby's good kicking all great um checked where the head is the he is low which is great he is where he's supposed to be his head's very low which is i'm so happy about because every time i walk honestly i feel like the boy is always at the bottom and i have to wobble so he's low and i feel like that is a good sign because he's ready to come out so cross our fingers so that's a good sign and he's measuring 35 centimeters and my last poem he was measuring 29 centimeters so that's a good sign and um yeah and then <clears throat> she took my iron i did an iron effusion like i told you about she took my blood test to see if the iron has you know developed good in that because sometimes it can go low and because i want a um like a birth center sometimes i can't like a birthing pool whatever sometimes i can't do that because if i have low iron obviously i have to have a normal birth like on the bed so they're just gonna double check that and see if that's all good but I feel like that's all good because I honestly feel like the iron fusion worked. Um, and then, yeah, she discussed about the birth plan. I said I wanted a birthing pool, birth center, all of that. Um, and yeah, so that is that appointment. And then the next appointment is in 14th of April, which is soon. And then I have one at 40 weeks. So I'm really hoping, guys, like, honestly, I'm hoping that I go... Getting to go into birth 38 weeks, which is, I think, around 14th of April, like, around that time. Because I know some people go in at 38 weeks. I just... I don't mind waiting for my due date. But I just honestly know that I'm not going to go on my due date. And I don't want to go around the 27, 28, 29, because that's so long and I want him to come. So, honestly, the way I'm feeling, I feel like he might come early, like, around the 6th, 7th, like, those times. But regardless of what she did say before i walked out of the room like if he comes early like we'll see you then we won't see you like so anyway at least everything is in check everything's great they know what i want they wrote it down in my notes because something just messed up like they forgot about me like they like appointment 14 of april which is a week before my due date it just that doesn't make sense anything can happen anyone can go and label early and I didn't have my birth plan in place. So I'm glad that I called them. And I'm glad I had my original appointment 36 weeks, which was today. So make sure you double check when your appointments are. Because sometimes they forget. And like when you're around 36 weeks, you should be getting checked regularly. Because anytime 
your baby can be coming out. So, yeah. And I'm done waving this fork, like, in the air. <laughs> but, yeah. I'll, I'll take that out later. Um, but, yeah, right now, I'm just going to sit and watch. <coughs> Too hot to handle. My husband went out. Um, he's got his friend's gig or whatever. And I'm just going to sit and watch and relax. I think I might... Um... Oh, there it is. I found it. My ear stud. <laughs> I think I'm going to go in um, and take a nap. But in the next room, but I don't know. I'll see how I feel. Uh, yeah. I have, like, dishes to wash, and I can't be asked. But, yeah. But anyways, I will vlog when I vlog. <laughs> Guys, it's like one something, and I just woke up. I am so exhausted. I'm so tired. I had like a delivery like around eight. Um for his changing table. But other than that, oh my god. I'm so tired. I need to get up. I need to get up. I need to go make brekkie. Oh god. Like oh. Guys. Oh. 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 My hair's a messy, don't judge guys. My belly is all out. Oh god. I just had the shower and yes, I'm wearing the same jumper but different type of thing. Guys, I'm nine months today. I'm so excited. Oh, I have so much washing up to do. Bloody I'm gonna make myself some cereal. I need to get new cereal as well. I need to like clean this house, like clean or everything. I'll do that afterwards. Um, not now. Um, I don't know what I'm doing for the rest of the day today. Um, Zay um, his changing table came. So, I'm gonna... Me and my husband are gonna fix that later. But for now, I'm literally just gonna chill. Um, oh, the, the one thing I love about my living room, guys. Oh, the heat is still home. It, like, heats up my living room so much. And I love it. But I'm just gonna sit and have breakfast and watch some TV. Um, until I figure out what I'm doing for today. Just cooked. Guys, I made the best tomato. Is that pesto, pesto, all of that? Mm. So good.